Hi everybody. Today we're going to do a um, multiple floral bloom, multiple colors floral bloom. So I have um, my color Walmart Color Place paint as a pillow already down on the canvas. It's right out of the can. Um, nothing added to it. And I'm going to do four different um, flowers here. We're going to modify these. And I want to keep them close to each other in the center so that when they spin, they don't go flying off the, um, the canvas. So I've got myself a little pile over here of my paints. I've got a red um, flower combination. I have an orange, a tealy blue, and a um, purple. So we're going to do multiple colors. I've been wanting to do this. So we'll see how it goes. I think it should be very pretty. And I've just got, well, I've got mostly three colors for each. Um, but some of them might have four. And I'm going to put a little bit of gold on this one. And I'm not going to put my cell activator on until the last minute. So we're just going to put down the color. So I think, um, I think we'll go the colors across from each other. So if I have the red one over there, we're going to put the orange one over here. here. I think this should be pretty. It's going to be sort of like a rainbow in a way. I'm tempting fate here because my phone has 25% power. I'm hoping it makes it through the video. I think it should. This one is one of the new colors I got. It's called Sockeye. It's like a beautiful salmon color. This one is called Ginger Peach from Primary Elements. The Sockeye was from this little piggy. Okay, and let's see, I suppose we should put a gold over that. That will look pretty. Okay, now we're going to move to our blue flower. that right over here this video is going to take a while obviously because we're putting down a bunch of color This is this little piggy tail feather. The 
this little piggy lake side. Just gonna check my video. Yeah, it's going. Couldn't remember if I turned it on or not. <laughs> Wouldn't that be something? Okay, that's our blue. And let's see, maybe we will put some, we're going to put a little bit of silver on top of that. Since it's a cool color, I picture the silver being kind of with cool colors and the gold being with the warm colors. So that's what we're doing. Um, now we're moving on to our purple. Uh, this is a little thick. That was Spice Plum by Primary Elements. This is French Kiss by Primary Elements. Royal Orchid. Uh, maybe a little bit of the silver. Sterling. Okay, so we've got our purple, we've got all our colored flowers. Now we need to add some leaves. So I'm going to, this is a little bit thick. Let me thin it down with my min water. My, I have a bottle of Minwax Polycrylic, three parts to one part water. And I use that to squirt into my paint if it gets a little thick and needs to be thinned down, which this one does because I haven't used it in a while. That's good. All right, so let's think. I think we're going to put... A leaf in between each flower. Okay. And we're going to have to see what happens here. We might have to add more things after we blow these out and spin them out. So we'll see what we need after we've done that. Maybe we won't need anything. This one is kind of 
you're just winging it to see what you get okay so we're gonna go with that now this is kind of moved over a little bit we're gonna bring it back we're gonna get our black cell activator and I'm gonna do these one at a time but first we need to pop any bubbles that we see good so I'm going to put my cell activator down and then I'm going to blow it and we're going to go on to the next one. Mm, I went a little too hard on that one. But that's okay. These will expand when we spin them out. Whoa. That one got away from me. Now we need just a little bit of cell activator on these. leaves Coming together good. get the turkey baster now we're going to get our tool and a paper towel We're going to kind of enhance these by, all right, that side's too thick. Bring them in. I'm working quick, not only because of my camera battery, but also because I don't want these to blend too much. So 
So we're just giving it that floral look. Get our blue. And I'm not even touching the canvas here when I do this. I'm just kind of gliding over the top of the flower and dragging this white inward. And now let's. like that right there so let's just take and give these leaves a little kind of coming out like so I have a lot of pillow paint on here probably too much this needs to go away so I'm just going to kind of make it disappear. All right. I'm ready to spin. Let's see what we get. Okay. So we have lost one leaf. Um... We need two, so that means it's too far this way. Yes, it is. So we're going to take and move it over this way. Oh, I forgot one of these in here. Oh, well, too late now. So I think what we need to do is we need to add a couple more things in here so let's do that and what color do we add let's go with another leaf over here Okay, I think we're going to do a pinkish flower. Well, huh, what to do? Let's do another blue flower. Boy, am I going through the popsicle sticks today. We're going to add a blue flower right here. I really like the silver um, on there. That turned out really pretty. Okay, let's take care of these two before we move on. Do these like so. Thank you. 
open. Okay. We need some flowers right here. So, but I think they need to be different colors. First of all, let's take and bring out some of these. It'll kind of, maybe we can just do that and not add any more flowers. Yeah. See what that does. Oh, I like this. Oh, yeah. I don't really know what color flower I would have put in there. Oh, darn. Okay. Do not drop your paper towel into your painting. That's drastic. <laughs> um, actually, I like that. I like this with that, that amount of... Um, negative space and I think we're not going to add any more flowers Oh, this is pretty. All right, let's spin it again. So we've got our greens. We have no green over here, but that's okay. I like it. We get another paper towel. Actually, let me just get a popsicle stick. I want to get rid of these few blobs of color that are where they don't belong. This does not belong here. That does not belong there. Okay. Now, we are getting some white little dots in here, which I want to get rid of. They don't belong. That is the pillow coming up through. And I don't want them. So you can just kind of yeah, wipe them away. I almost feel like we need one flower right there, but I'm afraid it's going to, I'm going to have to spin it so far in the center that I'm going to lose what's on the outside. So I'm just going to leave it as is with that negative space in there.
kind of try and drag that out a little more. What do you think? I think I like it. All right. I'm going to take you down here. Show you the close up. That is how you do multiple modified balloons. Here's our red, our orange. Kind of lost our blue off the side there. The purple is just gorgeous. I kind of did all kinds of swirly things there. Anyway, there you go. Hope you like it. I do. If you um, like the video, please um, subscribe to my channel, like the video, hit the notification button so you can see new videos as I post them. And thank you for watching. Okay, bye-bye.